Hey guy. Hey bud. He was just waiting for me to come outside, letting us know that he lived here now. He's a very dirty boy. Hey buddy, want another treat? We posted, we tried to let people know that he was here in case he belonged to somebody. But nobody had any idea where he came from. No one recognized him. And so step one was the vet. Go into the vet with our new dog. <laughs> so we got him in to get looked at. He did really well. He fooled us immediately that he was going to be a really even tempered dog. And then on the way home, we stopped and we washed him up because he was caked in dirt. That is a wet dog. Partner Shiloh immediately started using language that made me realize that he was invested in keeping this dog. <laughs> Once he was fully fed and safe and realized that he was going to be loved and cared for, he was fully able to have like a whirlwind attitude. Anything that he could get into, he could. We found out early that anything that was about shoulder height or lower was Balto territory. He'll be really adorable and funny, but it's like something he really shouldn't be doing. And we have to be like stern parents about it to make sure it doesn't happen again. But it's so cute. Give it back. Where did you even get? Where did you even get this? I think my favorite weird thing is when we find something that we definitely didn't purchase for him or for ourselves. Finding like a Subway sandwich. I don't know where he got the sandwich, but he picked out all the jalapenos because he didn't like them. We didn't eat Subway. We did not purchase this home. Walter, where are you? I'm glad actually that he is kind of a high needs animal because I want to be able to practice what I spend so much time trying to get other people to hear. As a gay trans person, often we are made to believe that small changes and adjustments and systems are not worth it for us. To not have that attitude in my own house is really important, that nobody's needs are too small, that everyone is worth consideration and time, even if it's going to be challenging, because I think our family has tremendously benefited from his presence. Did he take your bone? Did he take his bone? We're really, really lucky that he chose our house.